Hey guys, it's Exodroid again, and today I'm showing you my mock updates number two. So, uh, in this part, nothing really changed, and I did change uh, the bunker a little bit. I opened this up so there's like more space for the cannon to go. I also uh, did this railing, but I'm not quite sure if I'm doing this, if there's if there are people uh, are gonna be up there or not. And I'm also planning on building some sort of satellite right, right there. And I also decided to change the ATTE that was standing here with, uh, with a gunship. And you know, it's filled with troops and also uh, modified it so it has this extra door. Yeah, I'll give you another shot. And I also changed a little bit on the inside of the bunker, so I'll show you that right now. Okay, so here's the interior of the bunker, and I just blueprinted where the rooms are gonna be, and all this will be tiled up. And you know, now you can see where the doors are coming. I'm thinking of also including like uh, doors that close sideways, or just leaving them open, I'm not sure yet and you know here this will be the command center with the hollow table and stuff like that and right here you have this you know the back that tank that you see in star wars often for the med bay and there will be the armory with like bunch of guns and helmets and stuff and for the mock that's pretty much it i did get a lot of new pieces so i can start building again and i will be showing them right now Okay, so here is the hall or the the order that came in today, and it's a bricks and pieces order. So that means this just you're buying Lego straight from uh, the Lego company, you know. And you know it's not backed separately or something, but and anything like that. But I'll just show you what I got. So I got these 500 of these two by two gray tiles and. I also did it via, um, through Lego, so you know every piece is new. So this is what 500 tiles looks like, and they're, they're useful because you can use them in anything, in you know, other builds as well. And now this bag. This is one one downside from buying straight from Lego. They just put it in one bag. And as you can see, let's see what we can. And so bought a lot of the great pieces, you know, because I don't have a lot of them. Bought these, um, I think 50 of these. Then some, some tan tiles just to cover the ground. Got some, a beam here. Let's turn it over. So bought some pieces for, um, for to make trees. And also there's also a bunch of tiles in here. There's bunch of small pieces that I need to get more of and when I sort them I will show them again probably so that's that's the haul was about around uh, 100 euros it's definitely worth it to get that many pieces in one time so bye and I'll see so you later. back with all the pieces sorted out and I'll show you them one by one so we got around 20 of these tree trunk pieces uh, which I will be using to make trees uh, such as and 30 of these leaves then we got also 30 of these um, 8 by 6 plates you know just to cover the ground and not see uh, see the blue place uh, uh, base plate under it we got two of these of these beams support beams we got a bunch of the of one by two clear pieces and just there, there's some small pieces some big pieces like this this uh, 100 4 by 4 10 pieces just to also just for the ground also bought this big piece got a bunch of these for rock work um, such, and these as well you know, they, they, they are all, uh, always useful got some tiles some of these clip pieces some smaller pieces you know that I that I never got in my collection bunch of these these are also always useful more slopes and then this 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 was probably my favorite or uh, 500 of the 2x2 gray tiles always useful 
and more dark gray tiles i think 20 of these dark green ones um, plates and that's pretty much it i also wanted to show you what the bunker now looks like when it's tiled up so i'll show you right here so this is what it looks like i think it looks better without the railing i mean i'm not pretty sure still have to cover some of these pieces with tiles and then the bunker is pretty much done only have to cover this up like i did here and then do the interior tile everything up have to cover all these base plates so it's all green and then i can make it look a better tree than this because this was just a makeshift tree that i made so that's pretty much it thanks for watching and i'll see you in my next video